am on my way to Broughton Hall, which is the home of John Caldwell. He's the man who set up and sold uh, Phones for You and now spends his time as a, well, amongst other things, as a philanthropist. I spotted it 40 years ago down the driveway and thought, wow, that's just extraordinarily beautiful. Before we go inside, John's got the perfect way to give me a bird's eye view of the whole estate. I think I'm going to demand helicopter transport from now on. And they <laughs> see the whole estate. Astonishing. Built in the 1600s, Broughton Hall has been expanded and expanded by its various owners to create this huge 35,000 square foot house. And even from all the way up here, John's grade one listed home looks massive. Pleased to see you've got a small football pitch in the uh, wall garden. Yeah, in the wall garden there. Yeah. And also, it's here where you can see the accuracy of the mowing. Yes. So you can't see that from ground level, can no. you? No. That's beautiful. The first room John's showing me is possibly the biggest sitting room I've ever seen. And this is the Great Hall. Yeah, well, that, it's a very accurate description, isn't <laughs> it? It is. There's a, a knight or something on a horse sitting up there. Upstairs is part of the private family quarters, somewhere guests are rarely allowed to visit. And how many bedrooms are there? Say the uh, 15, to 15 in total in the whole house. Okay. Most of the other wing, most of that's bedrooms. But out of the 50 rooms in this huge house, the one that's used the most is the one at the centre of any family home. So this, this is the kitchen. Oh, yeah. This, for me, is the most important room in the house because I love cooking. It's basically where we live. It's also interesting for me because this is a... I mean, it's a vast house. Yes, it's a big <laughs> house. It's about... It's probably 35,000 square feet. But the kitchen, vast. actually, is relatively, relatively small, small, isn't it? Small, yeah. Now, is that a deliberate thing to make it more sort of... No, no, no it's it, it, it it isn't. I would have had a bigger kitchen if I could. But I wanted a, a place by the front door where yeah. you come in, and that's where your family are. And this is a beautiful corner because of all the windows, and we can see up the drive and see outside. So it just fitted perfectly. <laughs> Another part of my estate is the train. The train you have set. A train. That is not a train set. It is. It's a big train. The three mile narrow gauge line snakes around the entire estate, giving a completely unique view of the grounds. Riding a train in somebody's home garden. This has to be a first for me. 